Today on Afro Tech News, the new work culture may lead to a slimmer pay gap between moms and dads. Nick Cannon completes Nipsey Hussle's Dr. Sebi documentary, and Magic Johnson adds a black-owned natural health company to his portfolio. I'm Will Lucas for Afro Tech News. New research shows that the disruption to everyday life may predict two major outcomes for gender equality. Studies from Northwestern University report that moms will shoulder the majority of childcare duties during the pandemic. However, now that dads are forced into stay-at-home dad roles, the shift in gender roles may lead to greater gender equality post-quarantine. First, women are on the front lines. The U.S. Labor of Statistics reports that women hold nearly 78% of all hospital jobs, 70% of pharmacy jobs, and 51% of grocery store roles, which will, in traditional families, force men to become the main child care providers, says the researchers. They also predict that flexible work options will narrow the pay gap. A shift in gender dynamics may arise due to the adoption of more flexible work-from-home options for men and women. Researchers believe that this new work culture will remain in place long after the crisis and lead to a narrower pay gap between moms and dads. Prior to the death of rapper Nipsey Hussle on March 31st, 2019, he was working on a documentary involving the life and work of Honduran herbalist and healer, Dr. Sebi. Upon Nipsey's untimely passing, fellow rapper and filmmaker Nick Cannon vowed to see the project through. Cannon wrote on Instagram after Nip's murder, where you left off, we're gonna carry on. It's a marathon. So I'm picking up the baton because they can't kill us all. Now your message is my message. Your work is my work. Now a year to the date with the caption as promised, Nick Cannon has released a trailer for Strong Enemies, the untold case of Dr. Sabi on Instagram. We're in the holding queue for release date. Magic Johnson's latest addition to his investment empire is NatureAid, a black-owned natural health products company which was founded in 1926 and acquired by his best friends, Duke University alumni Kareem Cook and Claude Tellis. Witnessing many of their family members succumb to diet-related illnesses, Cook and Tellis decided to acquire NatureAid in 2012 after successfully launching Health Body Products, a healthy vending machine company in 2002. With the help of Magic Johnson and other NBA stars like Grant Hill, they're well on their way to accomplishing their goals of providing natural plant-based foods and products to urban communities across the nation. Cook told Whole Foods Magazine, Magic Johnson has been tracking us and watching what we've been doing for a few years, and he decided to become a significant equity owner. You can read the full write-up now on afrotech.com. If you aren't subscribed to the Afrotech newsletter, are you really about that life? All the exclusive content and subscriber-only promotions can only be secured by becoming an Afrotech insider. Join for free now at join.afrotech.com. I'm Will Lucas. For the latest in black tech, business, and startup stories, visit afrotech.com.